question eight. So these uh, value for money questions are almost invariably asterisk questions where, where you really must set things out clearly. So start off by having columns for each of the three options. So on this occasion, a 50 milliliter tube, a 75 and a 125 milliliter tube. Now it's always best to work out the money per amount of quantity because then you're comparing the money for like for like quantity. So start off by writing out the question again, money first, money first. Now it's easier to work in pennies than it is in pounds on these, otherwise the numbers start getting very small. So one pound oh nine is 109p. So this tube costs 109p for 50 milliliters. This tube costs 168p for 75 and so on. So really that's just restating the question. Now to convert each of these to what a single milliliter, you need to divide by the quantity. So 109 divided by 50 is 2.18. 168 divided by 75 is this and this divided by this is this. Now put the units in. So what we're saying here, this is 2.18 pen, pennies for every milliliter. 2.18p per milliliter. So we've got our three costs for similar amounts of toothpaste. So which is cheaper? Well it's clearly this one which is cheaper. So therefore the 125 milliliter tube offers best value for money.